Similarly, reef fish, like clownfish, rely on symbiosis with cnidarians, like anemones. The fish have developed immunity to the stings by secreting a thin layer of mucus over their bodies. Without it, the clownfish would be stung to death and consumed by the anemone. Other fish have a similar association with larger, drifting medusae. Those that are immune can take shelter among the jellyfish's tentacles, baiting the trap for other fish. In all these examples, we see creatures from vastly different groups depending on cnidarians for survival. This goes to show just how important jellyfish and their relatives are in increasing biodiversity in the oceans. Overall, there are so many different kinds of cnidarians that they have many different points of importance. Coral reefs are formed of many millions of cnidarians and are home to staggering biodiversity. Jellyfish are important predators in the open ocean food web, but they serve as food for many other species as well. Sea anemones fulfill a similar role but in the shallows, also serving as hiding places for clownfish. Thus, this unique and abundant group of creatures is integral to the function of many marine communities, from the open ocean to coasts and the benthic zone of the deep sea.